All right, and welcome back to another one episode of the One Defense Completionist Pure. In the last episode, we did finish the Hard Combat Achievement Diaries, and uh, we got us the uh, Hilt number three. So we can infinitely teleport to Trollheim now. Uh, we did also get a 101 key, uh, Kree kills, but uh, we'll go back to her eventually whenever we need to get all grind out all her uniques. That'll probably be one of the last bosses I do because of how annoying she is, but... Uh, who knows, maybe we'll get together with some friends and do some more uh, soon. I did take a week and a half break, uh, mostly to take some time off from RuneScape because I was really burnt out. But on the other hand, I was also doing a lot of work around the house and uh, fixing up some stuff, so that was kind of nice. So, we're back on the grind again, and uh, for the first thing, we're actually going to need to finish our uh, task, which was, if you do remember, Cree, or uh, not Cree, uh, oh my god. Uh, well, it's not going to show my task, but my task is aviancies, so uh, let's get back into it. I must have been killing all those minions, and I must have finished the task without realizing it. Somehow, I finished my task, uh, so I guess let's go get something new to hunt. What the hell? All right, here we are. It's a familiar feeling. Time to get a task. Let's get it. Abyssal Demons in the Catacombs of Corind. It's a classic. All right, yeah, I just bought runes, and... Uh, after restocking my runes, we've only got three mil, so we need to make some money, because uh, there's other stuff I need to restock, and then I need to expand my bank again. We've only got three spaces, and uh, I can't do anything with the demon head, so I think I'm just going to keep it as a trophy, I guess. Can't do anything with the hydra head right now, just want to keep it just in case, and obviously the hydra's eye, I need to finish that for the ring. So that's going to be fun eventually. Yeah, I'm just looking around, uh, I need to mostly just restock my potions. And I sold a bunch of Sam Fuse uh, to make to get money for <laughs> Death's Coffer. It's pretty embarrassing, but uh, yeah, just a couple things I need to replenish. This is going to be our first superior kill since we've been back. Uh, I've taken a couple weeks off, like I said, and uh, yeah, hopefully we get the triple whip drop here. Triple whips. And that's nothing. Alrighty, we're about a hundred uh, abyssal demons in, and we just got our first key of the ta oh ho what ho with double take. Uh, there's our second key of the task. Uh, correction. Uh, so fuck yeah. Um, okay. Well, hey, thank God we're at the end of our task, and I just got a whip. I mean that saved my life. Keys all together, and uh, we were able to make a uh, another dark totem. So uh, that's our first dark totem since last time, and. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and finish up this task. All right, and that's going to be our last Abyssal Demon for the task. Let's go ahead and kill him. All right, there we go. That's task completed. All right, and that task came out to be about 2.1 mil uh, altogether. All right, first off, we'll start off by opening our uh, keys up just to see what we get. Lucky keys. Go ahead and get something. Ooh, uh, that's bad. That's pretty bad, too. Okay, those were all shit. Uh... How much did that come out to? Right around 200k. Not not great. But uh, let's get a new task and see what else. Uh, trolls. Okay, that's not too bad. Alrighty, so we did get trolls in the Keldegrim uh, dungeon. So next to Irelica, we're actually going to teleport here with our uh, house cape. And uh, yep, we'll just run right over here. We go into the Keldegrim dun uh, entrance here. It's a little uh, like hallway dungeon kind of thing. And uh, right in the middle here is where we're going to be standing. Uh, notice we're pointing uh, westward and uh, here's the safe spot right here so we can actually get uh, trolls stuck right here and if there's actually more we can get them stuck in our little row here on these couple tiles and uh, same deal on this side as well we can uh, get these guys trapped over here alrighty folks we got nothing from that task but that's task completed and we'll go tally up the loot and uh, see what we made alrighty and we did come out to be uh, 79k Unar. Baby, back rip. Oh. All right, Kono, what you got for me? Hellhounds at the Witchhaven dungeon. Almost certainly there's a better safe spot here. I think I used a bo the bone over here in a previous video, but I'm just killing these two hellhounds I have tagged right here. And uh, as long as I'm standing on one of these three squares, I uh, am completely safe from these guys. So, uh, yep, yeah, that's just what I'm doing right now, and I just got a brimstone key. So uh, that was perfect timing to explain that. All right, brimstone key number two for the uh, trip. And we're hoping to get some clues here eventually. Because um, the hard clue uh, rate, obviously, for hellhounds is very desirable. 
All right, finally, uh, I think we're over a hundred uh, hellhounds in. There's our first clue scroll, and uh, Edgeville. Yeah, we can actually do it. Let's go do it. Huh. Well, that's a dead end. Okay, let's try again. Bro, it's the same fucking step that I just dropped like five minutes ago. Fuck off. All right. Here we go. Hey, that's a clue we can actually do. Let's go do it. Wow, we are just not getting lucky on the clues. That's another dead end. Number three. Another brimstone key in the books. Boom. Okay, y'all. We got a guardian mummy. If this clue turns out to be a dead end, I'm going to be really pissed off. I'm sure I've done this before, but just something about doing a puzzle box for a mummy. All right, sweet. We did this get a uh, hard clue casket. So there we go. Uh, that's our first one for this trip. Let's go back to Hellhounds and find some more. We've been back from our clue only a couple minutes, so we get another brimstone key, number three, from this task. And there's another brimstone key. Woo! That's number five. Wow, we're just rolling in the keys right now. Hell yeah. Not bad. I'd love to be rolling in the clue caskets, but, uh, I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's in the cards for us. All right, and that's going to be task completed, and we did get a uh, clue just a second ago. And we're... All right, and that did turn out to be a dead end, so let's go open our keys. So, we'll go ahead and get a task real quick. Hydras, hell yeah, there we go. Fuck yeah, that's gonna be fun. Um, okay, let's go ahead and open up our chests. Not bad, not bad. Four Rainar seeds, that's pretty good. Torsal seeds, that's, that's good too. Uncut rubies, that's not great. These are not bad drops so far. Wow, these are really good drops. Um, okay, there we go. And we'll go ahead and open our chest. Ooh. Oh, well, I already had that. Okay. I already had that, too. Oh, okay. I thought that was trimmed for a second. Okay, I had the enchanted head already. No no biggie. We'll go sell all this loot in a second. Uh, oh, yeah. We had the hard chest. Okay, let's go sell the loot. All right, and the uh, Hellhound task came out to be 898k. Sweet. Let's go do a Hydra task. Holy shit. I just got the Hydra's Fang. Oh, my God. It's actually pretty early, too. Not bad. So that's the second that's the second piece of the Hydra's ring. Oh hey, that's uh well that's a lot of uh that's a lot of bolts. Huh. I'm not uh recording every kill just because it would take uh it uh, last time I did that it took forever and it just made the trip last like ten times longer than it needed to. So uh I'm just recording the uh notable drops and that is definitely one of Oh oh hey hey hold on. Oh whoa, what the hell was that? Oh Oh, 150 kills. That's what that was. <clears throat> I thought I got another piece for a second. That freaked me out. Well, that's cool. That's another good task to have. 150 kills. All right. K kill number 158. And we did get another brimstone key. So that's pretty cool. Oh my god. That's the third Hydra head. God damn it. <laughs> no way. Really? Oof. Third Hydra head. Yep. Quite obviously, Slayer. Bam. Oh shit, I just got fucking Hydra leather. Leather, oh my god. Fuck. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. I knew if I stayed on a little longer that I'd get something good. I fucking knew it. Oh man. See, I was gonna stop at 90 kills. Fucking... Hydra goddamn fucking leather. We get an elite clue that we can do, so we're gonna go ahead and do this. Uh, hey! You're messing up my clip, goddammit! Oh yeah! Got that agility XP. We're gonna go ahead and <laughs> slide our way slowly over here to, uh... Can you walk over here? What the hell? Pick rare... F do I have to pick the flowers to get this clue step? Or... Oh, okay, I can sit there. Okay. It is probably one of my least favorite steps. In fact, all the wilderness steps are kind of annoying just because of the simple fact that you have to re-gear. Oh, fun fact, you can save a inventory space if you actually wield your knife. Uh, answer this please. Okay. Well done. Hand this back. Okay. There you go. Ooh. Ah, ape it all. Rip, lads. That's, uh, that's the end of the clue. Okay, we're gonna get down to the bottom of this. Um... I need an elite clue. Yes, we can do a master. Hello, we can do a master. We're going to Sherlock. That, that dog will be ours this video. That's going to be the thumbnail of this video is going to be that dog. And if it's not that dog, then, 
<laughs> then that means I didn't get it. All right, the smarter person would probably have grabbed a couple of tools before they went running out here, uh, just in case they could finish one of the tasks that Sherlock has. Uh, gym stall, that's easy. Cool. I always used to be so fascinated by this uh, gym stall as a kid. It looks so cool. But we're going to go ahead and steal that. Yep, that's mine now, bitch. That's too fucking bad. Wow, get one hit. Alrighty, so the next clue we, uh, step we did get was a hot clue. Uh, whoa. Ho! Oh, whoa! It's a tongue twister. Um, okay. Wait, did we pass it already? No, okay, we're good. We're good. We're here. We're here. Uh, the last time I fought one of these, somebody told me that you can't protect against any of them. What? Did I just not get it? Okay. Boy. Don't I just feel like an idiot right now? Oh my god. How much money did I just lose? I just lost like 200k, right? That's really fucked up, bro. That's really fucked up. I should have just asked somebody to borrow it. Honestly, I wasn't thinking. Actually, I don't think I've actually gotten this step. So, do I... What do I have to do? Oh, it's over here. I thought it was... Uh... Oh yeah, it's in between them. Okay. I thought I was going to have to do like part of the pyramid or something. I solved that puzzle just, uh, just like Autoblock, a champion. New recruit, Tony. Shazing Graveyard. I can do that. These Shazing steps have been coming in clutch. There's been a lot of them. <clears throat> really? Another puzzle? You bastard. God damn it. Alrighty, we're gonna take a break from Hydra's and Dead End Clues to uh, go do the holiday event. So let's go ahead and talk to uh, this fellow, and uh, we're gonna get this birthday event uh, started. Fun fact: my birthday was recently, so this is kind of uh, uh, kind of funny. All right, so he basically just told us that we need to go uh, find the guests for the party. So uh, we got our list, and let's go check it out. All right, we're gonna do the fishing contest part first. So we're gonna get some bait from Larry. All right. All right, we need to go to Big Dave next to the pond. Yeah, let's go ahead and just, uh, we're going to go ahead and fish here. He's trying. Any day now. Doesn't seem to be working. All right, we got to go get a different bait. Okay, he wants us to do a favor to get intelligence from Osmond. So let's go talk to him. All right, there's the report. And we're going to bring that back to him and get our bait. Ooh, that's in code. Okay, worth a try. Worth a try. All right, desert bait. Larry, you're about to get showed up, my friend. For a second, I thought I fished four mil or some crazy shit. Tiny fish. Yeah, owned Larry. All right, we won. Okay, so that's Larry. Yep, I won the fishing contest. I need to talk to big my big arm. Okay, let's go talk to him. All right, my big arm. What's up, my friend? Okay, I gotta talk to each of the NPCs in the cooking contest area. You wanna send us on some kind of crazy time travel adventure they cook? No? Okay. Oh, man. The murderer? Wow, he's here too? Everybody's here. The big old party, isn't it? And all the serial killers are invited. Okay, let's talk to my big arm. All right, I'm assuming we're just making a pizza, right? So do I use the banana? Yeah, I didn't think so. That'd be silly. Oh, I have to cook the pizza first. Okay, we're making some wacky pizza here. Hold on now. I need to burn the pizza. Oh my. Hey, am I getting fucking... Am I getting trolled here? Is this guy... Is Hans griefing me? What's going on here? Burn my pizza? Okay, now I've lost, right? I have to start over? You son of a bitch, I swear to God. Look, he does... Oh, perfect. Okay, he does like it. Thank God. I won the cooking contest. Hell yeah. Sweet. Alright, here we are. Captain, oh, Captain. Hidden treasure. We're doing a treasure hunt today. Oh, that did work. Okay. I thought it didn't work for a second. Cool. Is there a clue? Cool, cool, cool. Now what? That's going to be the uh, Skibitar shop because I've seen so many memes about it. Like that surreal animator or whatever his name is, the 3D animated guy who makes, uh, he, he does a couple of RuneScape 3D animated things that are just really creepy and weird. Um, but, uh, I just remembered that meme because, uh, of the wielding requirements of the four scimitars. Okay. How many birthday balloons are there? Oh, no, I'm just gonna have to look that up. Fuck that. <laughs> 30, my friend. Oh, sweet. Treasure chest. What do we get? We try to open the treasure chest. 
It's locked. So go back to. Let's go back to the quest beginning. I think they're probably all gonna come party down here, right? I need to use it on him. Oh, I gotta talk to the captain. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. All right, for some dumb reason, I thought that was the reward, but uh, okay, we're going back to the captain. Captain, here's your tre treasure chest. What do you got for me? Oh, right, you're coming to the party. That's that's the whole reason I talked to you. I forgot. Okay, cool. Okay, sounds like I gotta go back. Go back to the beginning. All right, let's see that reward. Ooh. Hello. A new invention, you say? Sand skis? Is that what those are? Oh my. Wait, I, I've definitely skied in RuneScape before in past events. You've definitely not invented skiing. <laughs> what? Didn't we ski during the last holiday event? Or like, the one before that? What? Is this guy crazy? See, stuff like this would be considered a glitch back in the day. But, uh, I guess RuneScape's getting fun. So, that's cool. Well, uh, I appreciate you, uh, stopping in for the holiday event. Let's get back to the, uh, other stuff, I guess. Alright, here we are. We're about to start the new quest, Land of the Goblins. We have all our quest items already, so let's go ahead and start this. We're not doing it day one. We're, uh, doing it pretty late, actually, so we already have a quest guide. Yes, I do want to start the quest. Alright, so we need to go find, uh, Zanik. Uh, who is apparently at the northwest corner of this uh, place. Is she in here? Yeah, I see her. There she is. Alright, let's see the dream. Oh my. Well, this is special, isn't it? This would be a pretty cool place to uh, go. I hope we get to go here during the quest. Yeah, I think it means something. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a quest, right? <laughs> oh my. Oh, this feels familiar. All right, we just got the black mushroom there. That's what we need for the black dye. So let's go ahead and make that while we're thinking about it. We need to talk to the goblin guard. Who are you? All right, they let her through. Can I go through? Oh, I need to go to the makeover mage, I guess. So let's go check it out. Alrighty, we got to talk to the makeover mage real quick. And uh, they should give us the ability to turn into a goblin. So let's check it out. Oh, apparently uh, these berries grow outside here. Yeah, they just grow right here. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh, goblin potion. There we go. I can turn into a goblin now? Okay. Uh, let's uh, go check it out. Okay, I do think we're going to have to actually... Uh, I, we can't wear anything besides our goblin mail, so let's go ahead and deposit our worn items. All right, we're back at the entrance here. Apparently, I can actually choose my goblin appearance. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that. <clears throat> let's figure this out. Oh, that one's pretty cool. That one's pretty cool, too. Um, that one, I guess. Perfect. I drank my potion. I just did it right in front of them. They saw me do it. I'm a goblin. Hello. I'm just going to climb down these stairs. Just doing goblin stuff. I'm a goblin. Ignore me. I'd like to get into that temple, please. I'm a goblin. Why you talk strange? Because I'm goblin. Ah, ha, ha. No. Guess again. No, guess again. Stupid toes. No. Wow, these goblin names suck. Ugly Blood. Yes, that's a good one. Ugly Blood. My name is Ugly Blood. All right. Yeah, that was too easy. Suckers. Wow, this is down here this whole time, huh? Let's search this crate and see what happens. Yep, that's the goblin mail. I thought, I thought that would be there. Oh, wow, you can just... <gasps> is this a new money-making method? Hello? Where am I, Goblin? You know what this kind of reminds me of? It reminds me of the, um... Ham. Yeah, it reminds me of the Ham, uh... Hideout. Alright, the, uh... She had her, uh... Teleporting ball thing confiscated, so... Okay, gave that to her. Sweet. Oh, she's fucking gone. She, she booked it. Hope I don't get in trouble for that. Um, let's see. Alright, so I think the plan is there's six keys for each uh faction here. So we just need to run on in here. Run on in here, find the priest, and pickpocket each priest. Yep, there's the first key. Okay. It seems like I need to go to Aggie. 
and unfortunately I'm gonna have to get her to make me a white guy, which is really annoying, because I'm already here. Uh, okay, Miss Aggie, I need a white die. Okay, so I gotta get some stupid fish. God damn it. Oh, he'll let us in because we won before. Cool, cool. Okay, let's go ahead and catch that fish real quick. Right here. There's the white fish. It looks like I can actually get back in here, which is really nice for PvP worlds. All right, Aggie, I got your fish. Let's go ahead and get this die. All right, I'm back in action. Got my white armor. I'm going on in here. I'm going to go get the last key. You dumb goblin. You got tricked by a human. It's going to be a reality. Going through the door. Going through the door. It's a goblin journey. We're going through the door. Do I want to enter the crypt today? Let's go on a venture. Hey, hey, hey. Na, da, da. Ba, da, ba, ba, ba. Oh, I don't have my weapons or anything, huh? I guess this is going to be a kicking fight, huh? It's a kicking fight. Up. Didn't even know what was hit. Do I got to talk to him while he's dead? Here he is. Here he is. Hello. Anticipate this being a uh, hard fight, but we'll see. <laughs> it's... Oh, there he is. Please. Oh my god, I might not kill him. Okay, I did kill him. Uh, I'm gonna go get some food, because I'm not gonna survive this. Alright, you son of a bitch. I'm coming back in here. It's a really good animation, actually, though. I really like how it looks. Oh, whoa! I, just as I say that, what the fuck was that? Come on, Jagex. What are you doing to me? You're making me look stupid. Red eyes. White dragon! Okay, yeah, that was that was him. Okay, he's dead. Tell me your name. Say my name. Say my name! Strong bones. Okay. Wow, he is strong bones. 184. Goblin. Oh, wow, it's a skeleton goblin. This quest is fucking awesome. This is a really good quest. I wish you could fight... Can you fight these in, uh... What is that? Nightmare Zone? That'd be pretty cool. Okay, they should all die, right? Okay, so he just told us that this guy that we're looking for isn't even on the same plane of existence as us. Alright, we're gonna have to walk. It's very sad. Hot frog burgers! Hot frog burgers! Other nasty stuff! Random nasty shit! Bro, where the fuck am I supposed to go? Oh my god, finally! Jesus, this took forever to find. I was going through that agility course looking for it. Oh my god. Crazy bird. It's working. It's working. Everybody look. Everybody look. It's working. First teleporter in RuneScape. World record. Gonna have a look at this box. Grave Robin. Grave Robin. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. What happened to you? Oh. Yeah, that's what happens when you grave rob. Generally not a great idea. No, we don't gotta go. I can use magic to open it up. I got 99 magic. I'm fucking awesome. Well, we, we finished the quest. We, we killed our goblin friend, I guess. Huh. So I just wanted to check uh, out of curiosity. Look, you can still get this goblin armor. I'm going to go sell it. Anyway, uh, we were here to check to see if we could actually start the mini quest, which uh, we can't finish for sure. But I was just curious if we could actually start it. So let's go in here. Yeah, it seems like Hope Spear, Hope Spear only, uh, only appears when you have the requirements of the quest. Oh, I did end up getting a elite clue, and it was a dead end on the first step or the second step. So I'll go ahead and give this to him. It's uh, it's been quite a while, but there's our second brimstone key of the trip. Jeez, so fucking dumb. I just got the level, and I wasn't recording. Okay, now I'm recording. Well, there's fucking uh, 96 fucking Slayer. Three more levels. Three more levels still I'm maxed. Alrighty. Uh, well, we have some weird stuff going on here. I don't know what the hell happened to this guy. It looks like he got mangled up in a uh. Oh, whatever, uh, a machine that makes you look like that, I guess. Anyway, uh, like I said in our uh, la last video, we're not going to spend all our money on bank slots. But watch as I do exactly that. Boom. Yes. 
And now we only have 250k. Woo! Hey, ho, whoa, whoa. Uh, what was that? 150 uh, kills. Hydra. Hi Al Alchemical Hydra. Or Alcon. <clears throat> oh my god. Can I talk today? Alchemical Hydra Grandmaster. Good lord. Can I, can I speak, please? With my... Ooh. All right, there's a hard clue scroll. So all we need actually is a, uh, we can't do this by the way. Uh, all we need now is a medium and easy. Uh, we'll do that tomorrow uh, when I get on. All right, there you go, Watson. Take that hard clue. So I was just looking at my uh, total level here. I don't remember saying this, but I think I said it preemptively. There's 420 million XP. Um, I wish I would have caught it at the right time, but I guess we'll... We'll, we'll catch it again when it's 420, 420, 420, right? All right, that's task completed right there. No pet, but uh, yeah, we got some pretty good loot. I mean, uh, 272 KC, and we've got, well, let's go look at the collection log. All right, and here we are looking at the log. Uh, we did get that Hydra leather, which was very helpful. Uh, it would have been awesome if we get the Hydra's Claw, but I'm not expecting miracles. Two Hydra heads, that was pretty unexpected and kind of toxic on Jagex's part. But uh, Hydra's Fang, Hydra's Eye, those are both very welcome. And uh, I think I did get those over, way over dropped rate. So we just need the Hydra's Heart for the uh, ring, for the Brimstone Ring to finish that up. Uh, so yeah, we've got a couple of things we need in here. Obviously we need the pet. That, that pet's pretty sweet. All right, we're about to uh, open up these uh, keys. Oop, my phone's going off. Cole, that was bad. Hmm. Yikes, double coal. Oh, wait, no, wait. Coal and iron, okay. Here, let's get our assignment. Something. All right, y'all. I'm, like, super lazy, so I just changed to a very heavy prayer setup and uh, <laughs> the ring of wealth. So uh, we're going to go ahead and just do this task in AFK mode. AFKing our dicks off, and we just got a, a brimstone key. Hell yeah. Bam. All righty, we got a superior. So let's go ahead and see what we get here. It's going to be a Dark Tone base. I'll take that. Alrighty, we got us another Brimstone Key. That's number two for this task. It's only been uh, maybe five minutes, and there's another Brimstone Key. It's only been a couple more minutes. Brimstone Key number four. Task completed. Here we are. We're going to go ahead and open up these keys and see what we get. Some Rune Helmets. Okay, okay. I can dig it. Oh, 200k. Not bad, not bad. Eh, that's not great. All right, uh, it's pretty middle of the road uh, loot altogether. So, uh, okay, cool. Go ahead and get an assignment and see what we get. Bronze dragons. Hmm. Yeah, that'd be a pretty quick one. Let's go do it. We'll go ahead and sell this loot really quick and see what we got for the uh, task. All right. Everything came out to be about uh, 1 million uh, 76 K. So uh, pretty good. And we got this ancient shard and this totem base. We'll go ahead and throw this in the bank. Bam, bam. And, uh, yeah, we're, uh, we're trucking along. Alrighty, here I am at the Brimhaven Dungeon, and I've got my anti-fire shield, and my, I'm sporting my new black dragon hunter crossbow. Pretty, pretty sporty. But, uh, we just need to drink this anti-fire anti potion, and with the shield, we'll be completely protected from these dragons, as long as they don't, uh, punch us to death. So, let's just run on in here and, uh, start getting some kills. Oh. I did just get a, uh, hard clue, and it's the Brimhaven Agility Arena, so that's, like, right up the road from us, so let's go do that, and, uh, because I would feel weird if I, uh, didn't do that before I did the last five dragons, because I'll obviously get another clue. Here's the parrot, and the answer is 33 banana trees. Alright, so we've taken the gnome glider, and we're just gonna go right over here and dig. <coughs> that is a dead end. Wow. Great. So it actually wasn't a dead end. I have to go through the abyss though, which is not my favorite thing to do, but uh, we're going to do it anyway. Whew, that was, that was really scary. Holy shit. Oh my god. Is that guy a PK -er? I might have to look at that clip again. <laughs> wow. Okay. Oh, man. Makes me wonder why I brought only, like, three potatoes. Three potatoes. Oh, potatoes. Was it worth it? Was it worth it? Another... 
another clue. It was worth it. Cool. Uh, wow. An another place pretty close to where we just gnome glided, actually. Wait, I didn't actually realize there's two gnome gliders so close to each other. That's weird. Okay, anyway. Oh, okay. That's, that's Crash Glider. That's why I couldn't travel here. Wait, can you glide from here, though? He's just going to say it's broken, right? Yeah, this glider isn't going anywhere. All right, we have slain the wizard, and this will be the end of our clue. Oh, nope. Just kidding. Fossilized. That is a soundtrack that I am pretty sure we have. All right, here we are for another music track, Fossilized. Thank you. I love that song. You've obtained a casket! We're, we have no self-control, so we're going to instantly open it. Well... And that is going to be the end of the Bronze Dragon task. All right, and the loot, including the casket, came out to be 159k. Not really worth my time. And the next task is going to be Aberrant Spectres in the Slayer Tower. Sweet. All righty, here we are at the Slayer Tower. We're here hanging out with the Crawling Hands. They're here somewhere. Oh, there's one. And, uh, yeah, we got the gym bag and the herb sack and the seed box. And uh, hopefully it will make our trips last a lot longer. And uh, I brought the Eldritch Nightmare Staff, but I don't think it actually can hit these guys. But uh, we'll see anyway. I'm pretty sure it doesn't hit them. Uh, and here's my setup for inventory. Just this lazy lazy prayer setup. Uh, and uh, yeah, we can just teleport back to our house and teleport right back with the Slayer Ring uh, to get free prayer. So that's going to be the uh, that's going to be the play. Okay, so I was totally wrong. I actually did just hit a 48 on this guy. And uh, they don't seem to actually be hitting as hard as I thought, so I'm wondering if I didn't change to a uh, higher range defense. I don't know if the range tu ranger tune that gives that much uh, defense, but uh, I wonder if that might be better here. Uh, but yeah, I'm definitely hitting, so I'll probably use prayer points when my food runs out. It's got uh, our first brimstone key of this trip. All right, there's brimstone key number two for this uh, task. Hell yeah. Brimstone key four. Oh, wait, that's three. Okay. <laughs> All right, we did just get a superior, so uh, hopefully we can get an imbued heart from that. That'd be really... Mm, nope, not at all. Oh, there's key number four. Hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Brimstone key number five. I'll take that. All right, and that's task completed right there. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get out of here. So let's go ahead and sell this loot. I have no more bank space. All right, all together we came out to be 460k. All right, the keys. Let's open them. Come on, Mystic. We have two pieces of Mystic, if you'll recall. Wow, that's a big drop. 233k, I like it. We do have two pieces of Mystic, and we, uh, we're hoping to get some more. Hmm, not today, though. Looks like we got some pretty decent drops, though. I like it. And I did remember, we actually, I, I promised we'd do a, a, a Master Clue because we had the Elite and the hard so let's go ahead and get the uh medium and easy and here's what it came out to be after selling all our uh, key loot it came out to be bing 1.1 mil not bad hell yeah all right here we are at watson we've got our easy clue and our medium clue it costs us about uh, maybe 200k 300k uh from implings so here we go we got our master clue is it going to be a dead end instantly let's find out Oh my god, black dehyde chaps and body. Okay, I wasted my time, my money, my effort, my sanity. Goodbye. Alrighty, that was a pretty low uh, time there. So let's go ahead and uh, gargoyles. Yes, that's a fun one. That's a good one. <sighs> Alrighty, there we go. We just got our first brimstone key. And we're just, uh, we're using the trick, uh, we've been using before where we just hide behind this bucket. Yeah, I used to use these crates and hide on either side. All right, there's, uh, second brimstone key of this trip. All right, another marble guardian dead. Oh, what? Oh my god. Yo. Finally. The imbued heart. No fucking way, yo. Holy shit, I needed that like something fierce. That's amazing. No fucking way. Holy shit, that's fucking awesome. That's task completed, fuck yeah. I think that was probably one of my best Slayer tasks ever, right? Jeez. All right, all right, all right. We're here at the Brimstone Keys. We've got two keys. Can we follow up that luck? Nope. That's to be expected. Nope. Yep, let's get another task. 
Steel dragons, man. These are some really shit tasks. All right, 972k without the heart. And my imbued heart just sold as I was going to check on, uh, what is this, Halo Tracker? No, wait, what the hell? Why did I, did I just have a stroke Halo Tracker? Oh my God. Uh, I meant to say the RuneScape Wiki uh, Tracker. Jesus, what, what the hell? Uh, did we get what we asked for? What the hell? Well, the total, uh, after getting screwed by the G, came out to be 32 mils, 256k. That's, uh, that's pretty good. Let's, uh, let's go. We're going to go over here, uh, to Edgeville, and we're actually going to buy our upgrade for the key, uh, wilderness drops. If you don't know, uh, in a recent update, they made it where you get loot keys, uh, if you pay this girl, uh, Let's see, do I have to do it in here? Bro, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm fucking unlocking this and I'm not even recording it. Okay, I just gave him the five mil, so that fucked our uh, 32 mil. Now we're down to 27. Okay, uh, okay, we did it. So settings, uh, turn leak keys off. No, we don't want to do that. Uh, drop food on floor? No, drop valuables on floor. What? What, would I get a key for the food? What? Why would you do that? I can feel... Okay, I can feel the. Okay, I can feel the draconic visage coming. It's it's gonna happen. There's task completed. Let's get the hell out of here. And uh, our last task came out to be 194k. So let's see what our get next one is. Dark beasts. Fun, fun, fun. We were recharging our prayer. Uh, actually, I was recharging my health because I almost died. But uh, here's a crystal impling. We'll go ahead and grab that. Okay, that's uh, 50k. Cool. All right, and that is going to be task completed. Hell yeah, there we go. We did get some pretty decent loot. Uh, the Snapdragons and the uh, Raynars being the biggest ones. All right, and the grand total came out to be 363k. All right, here we are at the top of the windmill in Lumbridge. So let's go ahead and search these crates. We got another clue and the Wilderness Mining ca uh, Bandit Camp. Okay, cool. Figured I'd go ahead and open this key before I go in the wilderness, and then uh, I'll go ahead and get it tasked, task two uh, while I'm at it. 250 shark. Uh, that's not too bad. Okay. Iron dragons. God dang it. Alrighty. He, he's taken care of. Bam. Another clue. What do we got? I climb up this ladder, and we're going to talk to this gentleman right here. Hello, you got a challenge scroll for me, good sir. Yes, 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 yes. Oh. Everything seems to be in order here. Thank you for that uh, challenge scroll. Thank you. Thank you. Fisher Realm. I th uh, pretty sure we can do this. This is the one that we unlocked by doing most of Holy Grail. Here we are. We're going to blow the whistle and enter the Fisher Realm. This is where you fight the giant usually, but after you do that, you unlock this area. And uh, this, is, this is where another clue step is, but I got to talk to the king. Okay. Go up here. Here's the king. Let's talk to him. You gotta do this challenge scroll. Challenge scroll? Good sir. I'm a warrior that saved the multiverse. No, I don't think I need to do a challenge scroll. No. No! Ah! Honestly, if uh, Isle of the Souls wasn't such a charming location, and uh, also the fact that I, I can get a draconic visage, uh, I wouldn't have uh, done this task. I, I was thinking about skipping it, but uh, there's brimstone key number one for this task. Uh, but yeah, just a chance of that. It kind of gives me hope. Whoops, that was task completed. All right, here we are. We were actually able to fit all the loot into one screen. Let's collect 106K. All right, we've got one key. Let's go ahead and check that. Cool. Black Demons in Taverly Dungeon. Hell yeah. Classic. Oh, there's a uh, brimstone key for us. Hell yeah. I'll take that. Uh, another brimstone key at the uh, Black Demon. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, we just got our third brimstone key. Ho holy fucking shit. I just got a casket. I've uh, I've failed so many clues, and I don't know how many I kept in that I failed. I probably cut a lot of them out, or I left some in, because then there'd be no fucking video. But uh, holy fucking shit. <sighs> Feels good. There's all the money from that. There's the key. 
We still have 22 more to kill, but let's go ahead and open it. I got something new. Lumberyard teleport. Wow. Oh, I'm spacing out. That's the uh, end of the tasks. I figure before I sell my loot, I'll go ahead and open these keys real quick. Ooh, torsals. Holy crap, that's pretty good. Not bad, not bad. Terrible, terrible. Let's get a task. Abyssal Demons in the Slayer Tower. Okay. All right, everything's in the GE. Let's go ahead and press collect. And the grand total comes up to be 818k for that task with the keys included. Yo, first brimstone key. Yo, key number two. I'll take it. Oh, snap. It's the third key. Oh, my God. Holy shit. There's no fucking way. Oh, I, I just... I just killed a superior demon and got an eternal gem. That's, that's fucking nuts. I just got a fu This game is crazy today. Holy shit. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, that's fucking uh, key number four. Uh, mm. <clears throat> Dragon spear. Yeah, there's the fifth brimstone key. We'll take that. <clears throat> brimstone key number six. Brimstone key number seven. And that's the Abyssal Demon task completed. Alrighty, here we are. We're about to sell all this loot. There's uh, the first batch of loot and the second batch of loot. And here's the last items. So, Abyssal Demons came out to seven keys and nine mil. Let's go open the keys now. Alright, the best part of the task. Let's go ahead and open these. Ooh. Okay, not as good. <laughs> Remember, we still need, uh, we've only got two pieces of Mystic, so any Mystic would just be really cool. Oh, no, okay. All right, let's get a task. Korasks. Cool. Okay, that'll be fun. And that is a additional 402k from those keys. Alrighty, there's the first superior monster of the trip. Um, well, gonna hit that. Yeah, oh, there we go. Okay, <laughs> there's the first one of the trip. Uh, nothing good, but uh, you know, we can't get a imbued heart every fucking uh, superior, right? All right, that's task completed. And uh, wow, uh, that was pretty fast actually. And we did get a clue scroll we're gonna do in a second. All right, the total came out to be 475K. Let's go do that clue. All right, I don't know what else I would have expected, but that is indeed a dead end clue scroll. Sweet. All right, it's time for another handy dandy task. Let's get into it. Mithril dragons. Huh. Okay. Got another task done. That was pretty fast. Not really any loot to speak of, but uh, you know, it is what it is. Bum bum bum. Black demons in Brimha Brimhaven dungeon. That'll uh, take me forever, and it'll be really FK. Sweet. So I just realized I'm an idiot, and I actually just used the uh, teleport scroll. I bought it for uh, 522k. And uh, now our home teleport is different. This is the uh, Shattered uh, Shattered Relics Leagues 3 uh, teleport. Pretty fucking dope. Wow, that's cool. Holy crap. Alrighty, here we are. Uh, and a uh, nice gentleman actually helped us buy two more of these kits because you can only buy five at a time. And we needed two more for the whole set. So here's the crossbow. And it actually... Oh, yep. There we go. The crossbow. I wish they had kept it with the uh, more mithril appearance, because now it looks like a... It, I mean, it does look like a rune crossbow now, but the uh, fire on the crossbow looks really fucking dope. So, let's go ahead and add the books. Oh boy, it's going to ask to confirm every one of them. It's really annoying. I think you can... Yeah, you can dismantle this, so I don't know why it's asking to co confirm that you should just do it automatically. But, uh... Okay, here we go. Oh boy. Yeah, I thought one ornament kit for the cannon would do the whole cannon but you need four of them that's really annoying <laughs> okay let's look at the book uh the book's kind of glitchy looking okay i guess that's maybe my god cape or my uh yeah it was my cape that was glitching okay the book looks really cool the uh the, uh, the altered god book uh form looks pretty pretty cool it, it kind of reminds me of the uh in runescape 3 they had a upgraded version of the god book where you could uh add pages to it and it would burn the pages so it gave people a reason to do clue scrolls and th that's kind of what these books look like they look like the upgraded versions of the god books but uh 
I would totally support that if they did that in this game. As as long as one defense pierce could use it. That'd be nice. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get three more of these ornament kits, because I feel uh I feel that Jagex has scammed me actually, but uh I'll go ahead and get three more of those and uh I'll put the cannon down and we'll see what that looks like. Okay, well I'm glad that the uh limit on these is five. Uh it would make sense if it was uh four four, because there's only four pieces you can use, but uh kind of a weird thing. Jagex, just don't ask for a confirm if you can dismantle it. There's no point. It's just obnoxious. No, 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 no. Don't fucking put the cannon down. That actually poses a question. What happens if I don't have the last piece of the cannon? I just have the uh, ornament one. What will happen? Oh, yeah, it won't add it. Okay, yeah, because it's, it's different from the other ones. Okay, good experiment. Wow, look at this thing. It's so crazy looking. It's like a steampunk uh, cannon. Let's set it up. Well, that looks like a uh, like a furnace from uh, like Falador or something. That looks really cool. Kind of wacky, but uh, kind of cool. That kind of looks like uh, <laughs> it's wow. Uh, that's weird. It literally looks like like a a blue meanie fucking circle jerk. What the hell is going on there? All right, well, the range uh, tab obviously just needs a lot of work. It's just complete chaos. But uh, on the other hand, the prayer tab that I just reordered, wow, I mean, unbelievable. I mean, how good does this look? All right, shout out to this uh, person because they, uh, they helped us buy those two ornament kits earlier. And uh, that would have been really annoying if uh, I had to wait. So, thanks. All right, there's a brimstone key. Ba -ba -bum. Whoops, uh, I guess I missed the uh, end of the task, but there it is. Torath in the Fremenic Dungeon. Okay, cool. And what do we get for our key? Lots of diamonds. All right, here we are. Here's all our loot from the uh, Black Demon task. And we'll go ahead and sell that. Sell the diamonds. Sell the air runes that I couldn't fit in the GE. And all together, we came out to be 221k. All right, here we go. That should be task completed. Yep. Rune light didn't fail me today. It does sometimes. It gets off uh, count somehow. I don't know how that's possible. But uh, yeah, and, uh, we've got a wilderness clue we need to finish. Uh, didn't feel like regearing while I was editing a video, truth be told. But uh, three steps left. Let's go do it. All right, here we go. We're going to go ahead and cash out that stuff sell this stuff real quick and the task came out to be a 242k okay it would have actually paid off to record that one because i got the chest uh okay cool okay here we go we're gonna open this up and it'd be really cool to get a unique Ooh, sam rocky install cool is this new too oh yeah they're both new Fuck yeah. Well, that was a nice surprise. Next task is going to be Gargoyles in the Slayer Tower. A very chill and fun task. <coughs> All right, another down. The hell? Did I just get a superior with no drop? Boy, that's so fucking despicable, huh? Wow. Uh, that's the first brimstone key of this uh, gargoyles task. There's key number three for this trip. Hell yeah. Brimstone key number four. Hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Brimstone key number five. Oh yeah. Task completed. And uh, wow, we're just having a blast. I think what I'll actually do, um, I think I'm going to save up uh, 100 keys like I used to because that would be kind of fun. And uh, yeah, let's go uh, sell our loot real quick. All right, here we are at the G just uh, selling up our few last items from the trip. And it would appear the task came out to be 991k. Oh, another task down and another task down. Not doing that one, though. Water fiends. That's so bad. It's like the worst task for cures. Task only cave? Yeah, that's pretty AFK. I'll do that. All right, we're finishing up the task. Uh, if you do see these squares I've got marked are actually where you can stand without getting hit from uh, this guy over here. But uh, yeah, that was task completed. So uh, I think we're actually gonna wrap up the episode there. Um, so next episode, we will start collecting a hundred keys for a hundred key opening. Hopefully we'll be able to do that next episode. 
We should get 97 uh, Slayer next episode, hopefully, I think. Um, oh, I should probably go sell my stuff real quick. All right, here I am just wrapping up at the GE. And uh, yeah, I appreciate everybody joining us for this journey. And uh, hopefully we'll have some more amazing luck like we did today. Because this fucking stuff with... Oh, the uh, test came out to be 79k. This uh, this crap with the uh, the imbued heart and the gem and all that that was nuts. I mean, I've never had luck with that. In, like, like that's probably like the best RuneScape luck I've had in a long time. But anyway, uh, thank you so much for joining me, and I hope you have a good rest of your day. And I'll give you the uh, celebratory uh, ring. Everybody, take care. <laughs>